In continuation to the APPSC uh, paper leak scam, the aggrieved aspirants of the APPSC uh, examination uh, will uh, conduct a mass rally on this coming uh, 3rd December under the aegis of the Pan Arunachal Joint Steering Committee. Uh, this uh, uh, rally is going to be a joint collaboration with the ANSU since they are the one who initiated this mass rally. Uh, as I have told you, this is going to be conducted on the 3rd uh, December. I am now uh, with, the, uh, with a few aspirants of the APPSC. Let us try to understand why uh, they are conducting uh, this mass rally. So there must be some reason. We want to know why uh, you guys are coming forward with this uh, mass rally. Yeah, actually, is it going live? Okay, uh, today, um, thank you for you know uh, asking that. Actually, we have this uh, mass rally. It's a you know mass referendum rally on third of this uh, December. So it is actually this whole thing, as you know, this entire scheme, uh, paper leakage scheme, has been in the news for the first you know for the past uh, three to four months now. And after, you know, we have seen a lot of things in this past few months. Mm. And even despite that, we still feel that, you know, the actual justice has not been done. Mm. There are the way our investigation is, you know, proceeding. And the number of arrests, the sequence of arrests we see, we still feel that the main culprits, the, you know, the, like, like how the investigation should be proceeding, that has not been, you know, that, is, that has not been the case. So that's why we have come together and this, you know, like under the aegis of this Pan Arunachal Joint Steering Committee. Mm -hmm. This particular committee is a culmination of different departments, different departments or different examinations of, under the, you know, under APPSC. Mm -hmm. So we all came together, all the, all the agrip aspirants of different examinations, we, we all have come together. Mm -hmm. And Abhi, we have, uh, we actually approached our apex bodies of the, you know, of the state like our uh, all Nisi Students Union and all Arunachal Pradesh Students Union. Mm -hmm. So after, after we had placed our grievances before them, they took a cognizance of whatever we had placed. Mm -hmm. And accordingly, you know, they also uh, had their own resolutions, they conducted their own meetings, and then they came to the conclusion that, you know, with, in collaboration with the aspirants, with the parents, and with the entire state as a whole. So we all are coming together, you know, and here, uh, all Nishi Students Union, they are spearheading the, you know, this entire movement. Mm. And then our students, we as agri students, we are also coming together. Mm. So that's why we have come, you know, we have decided to have this, you know, mega rally that is called Mass uh, Referendum Rally on 3rd of, uh, 3rd of December. Uh, can you tell us how many aspirants will be there and ex approximate numbers, if you can give us? Uh, actually, if you see if uh, the number of examinations which are being conducted by the APPAC, mm -hmm. there are around, you know, at least 15 to 16 different exams. Mm -hmm. And that those are different, you know, departments. So if we see different departments, you know, within these different departments also, there are so many numerous number of students. Mm -hmm. So approximately there would be, I cannot give you the exact number because, see, this particular movement which you are going to, you know, undertake, in, you know, in two days' time. This is not just confined to students. This is not just confined to the aspirants. This is about the entire state mm -hmm. as a whole. Okay. So we all are coming together, you know, uh, as an Arunachali, as, you know, as a bona fide citizen of Arunachal, because what has been happening and whatever revelations have been coming, mm -hmm. that is something which has never happened. You know, this is something very unprecedented. This is an unprecedented crisis. So that's why we all have come together and then we want to come up with a solution. Mm. Because clearly what, what is happening right now, that is not a solution. Mm. You know, we are, you know, we are being dragged into more confusions and more doubts. The way the investigation, you know, was supposed to be, you know, heading towards. Mm. Actually, we are heading in a different direction. Mm. The, you know, the areas where the investigation process should be focusing on, mm. that has been diverted. They are actually focusing on some, you know, the minor, minor areas. The main areas, they are not focusing there. So that's why here it's, it's not just about this. It's about because examination is not just confined to aspirants. Because from aspirants, it transcends to the family, their respective families, and as a whole. And finally, the entire state, you know, that comes under, under the purview.
So that's why in this particular rally, I cannot count the numbers in terms of aspirants. So here, you, uh, here, like the participants will be from different, you know, different sphere of the society. Like parents are going to come, the civil societies are going to come, and then the, even the you know social activists and you know other well wishers. In in short, entire Arunachal is going to be you know on that day. Mm -hmm, okay. So you're saying that uh, the investigation is uh, dissatisfactory. It is unfulfilling. Uh, hence this mass rally to show your adamant uh, that you are adamant towards your demand um, yeah exactly that that's what you can say like we are first and foremost why we are coming up with this particular movement mm -hmm. that's because we are not satisfied we are completely dissatisfied the way this has been happening of course there have been some developments mm -hmm. and we give we upload the the investigation agency, especially the special investigation, you know, cell that is the SIC, we give them some credit. But at the same time, there are a lot of unanswered questions. You know, especially if we see the sequence of events and the sequence of arrest. So far, what we are seeing is only the only the people who are arrested are either aspirants or their parents or their you know brokers. But what about the people from the system? The actual epicenter of the entire, you know, what, whatever has been happening, the entire this uh, nexus of crime, that particular area is completely ignored. That means we are, we are asking, where are the culprits from the system? Because so far what we have seen is they have limited their investigation process only till Take Jerang. Mm -hmm. We want to see people, apart from Take Jerang, where are the other, you know, culprits? Okay. Because it is impossible that he could have done such a huge nexus of, you know, like collaborated crime without the participation of, you know, other, you know, other officials. That is impossible. So we feel that this investigation process is still incomplete. Okay.